Good evening, uh, fellow Guyanese. This evening, I join all my Guyanese brothers and sisters in congratulating our students who did exceedingly well at the Cape and the Caribbean Examination Councils, Council exams. I'm delighted at the tremendous achievement of our top students. I want to congratulate all those students who no doubt exceeded their own personal limitations. I want to congratulate the parents, the teachers, the community, and all those who helped in shaping them and in allowing them to achieve this milestone. I want to say to them that this is just the beginning of a long road ahead, one in which their continued dedication and commitment would bring the same joy and reward that they experience today. However, it is sometimes very easy for, for us to get lost in this achievement. I urge them to stay focused, to understand that this is just a stepping stone, to be thankful to all those who contributed to their lives, to this accomplishment to enjoy the moment and to ensure that they experience the fullness of their hard work. To those who might not be satisfied or those who feel a bit disappointed, I say to you at 15, 16, 17, the world is still filled with opportunities. Guyana is still filled with opportunities. You have other chances. Do not be discouraged. Do not lose focus. Do not be disheartened, but find strength in understanding that you're still very young. You can rewrite your exams. If you choose to go into an area for skill development, an area in which you want to enhance your technical capabilities, look for opportunities. Seek out what you are most comfortable with and work towards ensuring that you too fulfill your desires and ambition. This is just a brief stop in a long life ahead. At this stop, some of us might be ahead of others some of us might believe we are behind others. But we are not really behind or ahead. We are on the same road together, arriving at the same destination eventually. And that destination is one in which we empower ourselves, we develop ourselves, we educate ourselves, we advance ourselves so that we can participate fully in the development of our country, the advancement of, all, of our own lives, and the contribution to community and society. So my message today is for those who have done exceedingly well, you must be congratulated. You must be encouraged to continue. And for those who are disappointed or might not believe that they've lived up to their expectation, I say to you, this is just a brief stop on the road. Recommit yourself. Rededicate yourselves, refocus, rethink, realign, and reposition yourself for success. All of us, all of you out there, you have the ability. Some of us have ability in different areas. Like myself, I'm very poor. I'm very poor in art. I'm very poor in music. I don't have many skills that many persons out there have. But that is how life is. We're, we don't have equal strength in different areas. We just have to find that area we're strong in. So today, as we celebrate with all those who have done exceedingly well and all those who wrote the exam, I do not want us at this moment to ever believe that this is the end. This is just a brief stop along a long journey ahead. As I said at 16, 17, doors are now opening. 
This is by no means the end. We have a lot of time ahead of us. You have a lot of time ahead of you. Make the best use of this time. What this gives us is an opportunity to pause and to analyze those parents who might be a bit disappointed. I say to you, this is the time to show strength of character. This is the time for you to support your children, to encourage them, to give them that added motivation that they still can achieve and they will achieve. Let us together work on building our young people with strength of character, with dignity and honor. And in so doing, we'll allow them all to realize their full potential. I want to assure those who were successful, those who have done exceedingly well, those who are a bit disappointed, let us all come together in supporting each other. Let us all understand that our country presents a platform through which all of us would have an opportunity to develop and advance. Once again, congratulations to all the students, to the parents and teachers, to the communities, to the churches, mosques, temples, all those who supported our young people at this stage of their life. But remember, this is just a pause on a long journey, a journey that requires continued focus, dedication and commitment to ensure success is throughout this path. Thank you very much. God bless you. Good night.